Hello and welcome back to Cookie Run Great Run with Aldroy Galgon and in this episode of the last time that I will show you um, the hard mode against Castle Queen B um, this is believe it or not the final attempt that I ever done on uh, Castle Queen B it is like literally the final day of um, this boss fight and when I was doing this um, this fight, this boss fight, um, it was like uh, two o'clock in the morning. So I'm like really sleepy right now. So I hope that I can uh, get a very good result in here. So the strategy to the run itself, um, we actually use two pomegranate cookies and one birthday cookie. Uh, we don't use uh, blue lily because uh, we figured that it will just slow us down in terms of our attacking capability. And this is before. Um, the pomegranate and birthday cookie abilities were removed from this first season because it turns out that uh, in the next boss fight after this one, I think it was uh, Bomb Cushion Trian, I forgot which boss fight it was, but basically uh, after this boss fight, it turns out that uh, for some reason Death Sisters uh, screwed up, um, as I screwed up there, <laughs> what a coincidence, um, but um, but the way that was like completely unavoidable either I go down and then crash to an obstacle or I go up and then crash into the another obstacles and oh I crash again <laughs> it's not a good, really start to a good run is it uh, but you have to remember this is uh, before the time where um, the the obstacles were just like completely readjust to prevent such things happen ever again so in this case, uh, birthday cake and pomegranate cookies ability is that actually um, they can, uh, well not they can actually, um, pomegranate cookie can actually give us a bunch of uh, blue jellies that we gather there in order to use our skill. And also we use birthday cookie because uh, it turns out at level 11, a birthday cake cookie uh, ability also grant buff to our attacking power. And also we use Angel's Cookie, that's also because for the very same thing, although Angel's Cookie's ability is that uh, it, calls, it can also heal your uh, party member, so if I somehow screwed up like uh, the previous two occasions, um, my health won't be like completely empty by the time this thing is over. So anyway, uh, we go into the first task here, um, yeah you can go completely wrong in here but just like that uh, like I almost did there but uh, thankfully I managed to avoid it and we got a great one uh, not perfect but hey still a good result in here and now we get really being awarded now it's time to deliver some as hell um, I'm actually I think I'm the only one that actually used blue lily cookie and I just realized it that now um, and that is simply because um, I'm the only one that has blue lilies at high enough level uh, even though it's not uh, really high level enough to grant additional ability but um, but like at the time this is the only two that uh, the ability that I level up which is Neckfoot's ability and also Blue Lily's ability and and I hope that Blue Lily uh, despite uh, we figure it out that I'm the well I'm the only one that has enough capability to use Blue Lily cookie and so and that should give me the ability to get the triple s rank well at least this is before we actually thought that this is possible because um right before this uh the score readjustment i think there's hardly anyone in the community that has the capability to reach an s rank oh, uh, like that um this is why angle cookie ability will be like really useful or in case uh, things like that go horribly wrong and I think that's pretty much sums up about the strategy and the rest of us are going to use uh, snake food cookies ability simply because uh, the boss fight is actually weak to snake food cookies attack and yeah and also you can see in this is the first season because one, uh, this boss fight didn't appear in the second season, it was replaced by Soboro Queen Bee, which is like a complete reskin of this boss fight again. <laughs> oh yes, this is the very best thing 
that the sister came up with within the 6th anniversary update. <laughs> oh, I should mention that um, that task previously that I did see managed to complete, that can go horribly quite wrong and uh, because like you have to turn those obstacles into coins but the thing is though um, there is only one uh, coin magic capability to change it and it is like completely random so you have no idea where it is until you have to actually see it for yourself and then react quickly enough to do so and yes oh yes there is one more thing that needs to mention uh, sometimes I deliberately take a hit there uh, and that is because I want to get the blue jellies there because uh, according to my theory well at least the, the, the chat before the run that we have to get pretty much every single blue jelly uh, that we collect to use all powers and even we miss just one that is like a really huge problem and even if like we generated more by using two of our pomegranate cookies which um, yeah that's not to be the case but at the time we just basically theorized that uh, that's the only way we can get uh, into triple S rank oh yeah um, another thing that I should, men I should mention that um, at this point I was like really desperate into getting into the triple S rank so I like invited a bunch of uh, discord members to actually help me getting it and I we tried it I think this is uh, the sixth attempt that we try this. Um, I think that the third, fourth, and fifth one uh, we ended up with worse score than this. So that is the reason why I will never put up the video about that because um, the scoring itself is is worse, and also the strategy remains pretty much the same. Only if uh, you know this is the final version of it and. Yeah, after we theorized, we experiment, uh, experimented a lot, and we just find so happened to get it the best combination possible. Anyway, I'm Osroy Galcon, signing it off, and I'll see you on the next video of Cookie Run Oven Wake. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell. Everything is free, you don't need to pay, and by subscribing you make me happy and this channel grows and flourishes even more so I can create more content on this channel. Anyway, I'm Alzroy Galcon, signing off, and I'll see you on the next episode. Take care, and bye bye.